everyone, it's leftovers for dinner, and I'm protecting my strawberries. Uh, I got two strawberry plants, and when strawberries, you know, when they go from the flower to the little fruit, a lot of times they hang down and they hit the ground, and if they hit the ground and stay on the ground too long, they turn yucky or they get soft spots or they rot. So what I've done is um, actually uh, talked to a couple of people and a few people said put pine needles down. So that's, that sounds reasonable. Uh, I talked to them about you know the whole pine thing and pine oil and there's not much of a problem with that. In fact the strawberries kind of like it. So I don't have any pine trees in my yard. Um, decided to take Ben for a walk and I came back with two bags of pine needles and just you know pine needles out in neighbors yards or along our walk just you know if you have a neighbor that has them say hey can I have a handful of pine needles and that works uh, so brought them back and what I did was just take a pair of scissors and I cut them into a bunch of different lengths and then what I did was I took the short length and put it right up underneath the strawberry plant as far high as I could go and then I lifted the plants above them and set it down. I did the same thing with the flower. And that way, you know, as it grows out and over, it can just lay on top of the pine needles. And here's one I haven't done yet. So what I'll do is I'll take the short stack and I'll put it up as close as I can. And then I'll take the next length and just lay it on top uh -huh. of that. And then once I go around the outside, I'll take the longer length. And again, oh, look, see, we got a strawberry right there. And okay, let me put it in macro. See, we don't want his underside to get soft right there. So we just put some pine needles there. There we go. And now, when he grows, he'll be all right, and hopefully, won't turn brown. Now, the rest, I've got plenty of pine needles. That's why I decided to go ahead and trim them up and make them pretty, just so they fit into the container better. Uh, all the leftovers, well, I can actually just put that in my container garden just to keep it warm. Uh, it's Virginia. We're already, you know, kind of hot out here, but we do have some cool nights. So just a way to, you know, do things on the cheap and still get lovely strawberries. Thanks.